So I've been animating since I was a little kid. I made this animation when I was about 13 years old, but I was animating and programming probably from about the age of nine. And I just wanna go through some uh, files here. So I, I made this when I was probably about 13 on some Adobe product I can't even remember the name of. And this uh, gust of wind animation was also made in the same program. But I think those are the only two animations I ever made with that program. But I used to um, animate with Adobe Photoshop. And these are some files that my mom sent to me. And these are from about the ages of 13 to 16. I think I made this while I was at school. But this is an imitation of the type of thing I used to do when I was about nine years old and sent to Canada. Um, how do I watch this now? Slideshow. Slideshow. So this is one that I made in PowerPoint uh, when I was about 14 or so. And I actually made it, um, I have to prompt it. I actually made it uh, in class to show my friends that I could do it. Uh, and it's, it's pretty violent, you just ran over a person. Um, but I used to make lots of these and pretty much all of them are lost uh, to time. Um, and then there was this one behind enemy lines. Let's take a look. It looks like there's two here. I don't know, because I was looking through them the other day and they, there was one that I seem to be missing. Um, and this one's actually a little bit like a game. Uh, play movies. Behind enemy lines. I don't know if I've seen this one actually. It's got some Uzis. So there's been a security breach, intruder alert. Damn. So this was done with stop motion animation. And I think that's, that's it. That's all I had time for. Oh no, there is more. There is more. I think a guy just throws a grenade and then everything blows up in a big cloud of, yeah. But I, I, I made so much more that's just lost to time. Like with stick, I made some awesome things with stick pivot animation. And the reason that it's lost is because at the time we didn't have internet and we didn't have YouTube. So I would just make videos and my mom would send them by email to like her friends, but I never published them or anything like that. And they just got lost to, um, lost to time, unfortunately. Uh, this is really just a taste. I was trying to like relive my, my earlier days. Uh, oh, this is just the same thing. I'm pretty sure there was another one. Uh, and these are like some of my science experiments um, and stuff. Uh, but yeah, this animation lunchtime is also one of like a thousand animations that I made, uh, stop motion animations that are also lost, but some of them still survive um, on my other channel. I've got like four channels. The other channel is uh, Plumber Leyland and it's got like a it's just got a collection of these old videos that I made this was probably the highest quality one that I made and uh, probably not the best one but the, the one that that sort of um, ran continuously without glitching out too badly and it also had like a nice ending to it um, yeah but if I could have anything in life it would just be my all my lost projects and lost files and I, I think about them every single day and how like if I, if I had published them at the time that I'd made them, I could have had some kind of uh, reward for it, you know? There's so many people who post videos or posted videos in like 2009 that got so many views and they weren't even that good. And I was making this stuff in 1999. I was making stuff like this. Um, anyway, that's
that's my video for today.